Here is an aircraft where the pilot has reported that he couldn't get his flaps down and he had to use the emergency method to lower the undercarriage. First check the air pressure. Next, the oil level. Remembering that as the flaps are in the up position, the oil level will be correspondingly high. As both of these are satisfactory, it would appear there is no external leak. The hand pump should now be checked, and if there is no resistance, an internal loss of pressure can be suspected in a leak from the main pressure line into the return pipe. There is no resistance on the hand pump. From this diagram, it will be seen that if the short-circuiting non-return valve is unseated by foreign matter, the hydraulic fluid will take the line of least resistance and escape to return, and pressure will be lost. To locate the valve, remove the underside panels. Here is the high pressure line we saw in the diagram, and this one is the return to the reservoir. The non-return valve that we suspect is connected between the two. With the aircraft trestled, remove the valve. Before removal, do not forget to release the air pressure in the reservoir, otherwise oil will be lost as soon as any union is slackened. A matchstick will conveniently depress the valve. The air pressure is released. Having removed the valve, check for fault. The valve seat is badly worn. Obviously, the trouble lies here. A new valve seat is fitted. Before replacing, the valve must be tested for leakage on the test rig. The valve does not leak under the pressure test. It is now serviceable. On replacement, see that this arrow points to the correct direction of flow. That is, from return to pressure. Having serviced and replaced the non-return valve, test the hydraulic system by operating the various circuits.
Undercarriage, correct. Radiator shutter, OK. Flaps operate. With the flaps and radiator shutter down, top up by filling the reservoir to the correct level and inflating the air bottle to the proper pressure. Remember, high service ability is the reward for clean and careful maintenance. Know your gen and keep them in the air.